In this Learn Electrics video, we will look a little deeper into lighting circuits and compare the differences between two common wiring styles. Some recent questions have included How do we connect the wiring for two way lighting in a two plate lighting system? How can we convert two plate two way lighting into intermediate lighting? And what is the difference in wiring between two plate and three plate lighting? for two-way and intermediate circuits. We can begin with two-plate lighting and this video will be additional information to other videos that we already have on these lighting circuits. For clarity and understanding in this video we will identify cables as shown here. We are using standard grey twin and earth cable and to help to identify which cable is which in the drawings we will use plain grey for the switch cables and for the feed we will mark the grey cable with yellow dots on the drawings and then for the strapper cables we will show these as grey with purple dashes. Strapper cables are a three phase plus earth cable that we often use in two way lighting. To make a two plate two way lighting circuit we will need a feed cable or permanent live into the switch marked here with yellow dots. We will have a switch cable to the ceiling rows shown in plain grey and we need a three phase plus earth strapper cable from the first switch to the second. This is shown on the drawings at grey with purple dashes. On this slide we have not shown the CPC or neutral conductors to make things a little clearer and easier to understand. These are the conductors that perform the switching functions. The chart shown here will show the effect of different switch positions on the lamp. Pause the video and follow the route of the electricity down the feed cable, through the switches and along the switch cable to the ceiling rows. And this slide shows all the conductor connections for the two plate two way lighting circuit and we have included the wiring to the lamp. This is how the completed circuit should look and don't forget that we have lots of videos with more information on the wiring of lighting circuits and how switches work that are available on our YouTube channel and on the website at learnelectrics.com. Now we can look at three plate lighting circuits. Shown here is the cable layout for a three plate two way lighting circuit. The feed or live loop cable marked with yellow dots goes directly to the ceiling rows not to the switch. A switch cable in plain grey is routed to the first switch. And lastly, a strapper cable marked with purple dashes here goes between the two switches. And this is how the phase cables are connected to perform the switching function. And remember, we've left the earths off for clarity. Pause the video and follow this wiring using the table shown. The route of the electricity should be down the brown switch wire through the switches as per the table and back up the blue switch wire to the ceiling rows. Note that the blue wire is not a neutral with this system and should have brown sleeving showing at each end to indicate that it is a phase conductor. And this is a completed three plate lighting circuit wired as a two way with all the wiring in the correct positions and with the black and grey conductors marked with brown sleeving. Pause the video and take a moment to understand it. The next question was about intermediate switching, sometimes called three way switching. Although properly wired, we can have as many ways as we want three way, four way, five way, it doesn't matter. We can either build a new intermediate circuit from scratch or we can convert an existing two way into an intermediate circuit. This is a two plate circuit wired for intermediate switching. If you have a two way lighting circuit then all that you need to do is to install the cables so that the wiring to the intermediate switch is between the two two way switches. The connections to the intermediate switch are made with three phase plus earth cable often called strapper cable. Take a moment to follow the electricity flow along the feed wire through the switches and up the switch wire to the ceiling rows. Again, we've left the earth or CPC off these drawings for clarity. And this 
is the wiring for a three-plate intermediate lighting circuit. Again, note that the black and grey strapper conductors are marked with brown sleeving as well as the blue switch wire. They can all be phase conductors at some time. So we started off with two-way switching. Easy to do with either two-plate or three-plate systems. Both switches must be two-way switches. Then we looked at changing the two-way into intermediate switching. To do this, we arranged to wire an intermediate switch between the two two-way switches. The two-way switches must always be wired as the first and last switches. Following this convention, with two-plate or three-plate systems, you can have as many intermediate switches as you need, three-way, four-way, five-way, and so on. And that's it for this video. Still to come in later videos is two-gang and four-gang switching. Hopefully, you found this video useful and added a little extra to your mental toolbox. Thank you for watching. It really is appreciated. Please subscribe to our channel to get access to all of our videos and remember to click on notify to be sure of not missing our next video. And you will find even more information, videos and help on our website at learnelectrics.com. And don't forget that you can also type in Learn Electrics, all one word, into the YouTube search bar to go directly to our channel at any time from any computer. We are constantly adding new videos to our channel. Don't miss the next one. And once again, thank you for watching and we hope to see you again very soon.